Hariyam, it's day 170 of Song Divine. We're in chapter 11, the vision. And yesterday we kind of were left with a cliffhanger because uh, Arjuna has asked to see God. You know, with he says, I can't see it with my human eyes. I don't understand. I, I, I want to be able to see it, so show me. And Krishna was like, yeah, but God is all around you. You can see it right now. And this isn't enough for Arjuna. So let's see what else Krishna says. Krishna says, But with your human eyes, you cannot take it all in. I give you a divine eye so that you may see within. So Krishna understands that as a human being, Arjuna is limited in what he can see. The human eye can only see outward appearances, you know, we can't, we can't see our own eyes. We have an eye, but we can't see our own eyes because our eyes are seeing, right? So we're limited in what we can see. Krishna agrees to give Arjuna a divine eye so that he can see God, the spirit that underlies and unites all apparent form. So he does. It all happens, and Arjuna says, O oh Lord, in your body, all that I behold, all the gods and goddesses, all the diverse beings in your fold. So right away, Arjuna is overwhelmed. He starts to describe everything that he's seeing, and he sees all the gods and goddesses and every being in the world all within the body of Brahman. You gotta hear more. It gets so good. Okay, see you tomorrow.